All right, so to manufacture these face shields, there's two steps. First step is the bottle, so it makes the actual face shield. And then the second step is making the headband um, that they're gonna get Velcroed onto. So the bottle, what you need to do is get yourself a clear plastic bottle that is symmetrical, so no funky shaped bottles. Um, that way you can cut it and they can stack right up against each other. Um, you can put about six or seven of these together. So take your bottle, take the label off, empty it out, clean it out, you wind up with that. Then we're gonna cut it down. We're gonna take a knife and we're actually gonna cut the bottle and you wanna leave um, on the lip, you wanna leave that arc to come around a little bit because that's gonna wrap around the medical professional's face and you're gonna cut that right off all the way around and you're gonna do the same thing all the way at the bottom of the bottle and you're gonna cut it all the way right around and then it's gonna leave you with that. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna find the glue on this and you're gonna take your knife, cut straight down and straight down so it'll wrap up. And then to make nice for your doctors, you're gonna cut off the little corners because these little corners, that can cut skin. So we're gonna take them and just round them off real fast. All right, now to finish the mask, we're gonna take the soft part of Velcro tape, cut two small pieces, and these are self-adhering. So on the top of the mask, or the part of the bottle that's rounded in, you're gonna put them about five inches in from the outside and about an inch down on each side. Oops. And that's it. Once you got your headband done, it's gonna stick right to the headband. Now, to move on to the headband, simply a pair of suspenders. And we're gonna take the suspenders off the wrap. The bottom, the back half of the suspenders, we're gonna cut clean off. You don't need that, you only need the two front portions. And one pair of suspenders is gonna make two head straps. So now that you got the suspenders cut, you're gonna unlock the clasp, and you're gonna slide this slide right off. Completely worthless. You're gonna take the stitched side, the exposed stitch, and leave that up, because this is gonna be the front of the headband. Now, next step, cut yourself an appropriate piece. This is window insulation tape, and you need about six or seven inches of that. So you're gonna cut that, leave it right on top, and we're gonna heat up our glue gun. Next step, we're gonna hot glue this piece of insulation tape right onto the headband. Uh, as a safety measure, we're gonna add a little bit incrementally hot glue in about one inch segments. Now on our headband, which used to be suspenders, and we're gonna put adhesive side down that window insulation tape. And we're gonna pull off the stripping, and that's not sticky at all. But that's good, because somebody's hair might get there. Next thing, we're gonna take our sticky Velcro tape, and we're gonna cut off a piece of Velcro tape about the same length. And we only need, and this is very important, the plastic side, not the soft side for the headband, the plastic side, because that can be much easier sterilized onto the headband. And we're gonna drop it, oops, right in the middle of the headband. If you wanna cut off the sides, that's fine, you don't have to. And now, to doubly secure, because when you pull off that mask, it could pull off this, even though we've got it super glued, we're just gonna put a couple of zip ties at each end, and we're gonna put one in the middle, and that is gonna snugly secure our headband in place. These zip ties, there's no secret to it, just make sure obviously the thick part of the zip tie is not gonna be hitting your professional's forehead, so try, I like to try to point it up. And that's it. You got yourself a headband that's self-securing, very durable, elastic, so it'll fit anybody's head size secure, so it'll keep it nicely in place. Your face mask that we made, will adhere directly to it. And you can put goggles underneath it, you can wear a mask underneath it.